hello everyone so hope so the preparation is almost been done the student who have been appearing in electrical and electronics they had been fully prepared and if it is not been fully prepared don't think anything just have a complete sleep and tomorrow put your complete effort that's it you can do but anyways the agenda behind today's video just have a look of the kind of questions which have been asked in computer science and mechanically specifically in mathematics and from there at least we will try to infer which kind of the questions may get raised in electrical as well as electronic side so here comes the first question which had been experienced by computer science people see this has been a problem of a triple integration this has been a problem of a triple integration and what i feel the triple integration is always been a important topic triple integration is always been an important topic so even tomorrow also you may experience this kind of problem although it might be looking scary but this has not been that difficult you have to keep doing the integration 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 and in the end of the day the function which gets left out no it used to be odd function and once you will take its limit where the limit goes from minus a to a the result is being zero but what I feel in future you can have this kind of problem as well. It has been a kind of entity. And as it had been communicated earlier and now also I am telling the maxima minima has been a pet question. Definitely you sure thought you are going to get one question out of it. This has been a cubic polynomial. Taking the reference of this cubic polynomial, a MSQ question has been framed. And here once you will see the MSQ questions, no uh, options, few of the options were contradictory. See fx has a local minima, fx, fx 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 does not have a local minima so what i am saying out of four number of options two options were contradictory so i had seen at least in uh, today's paper if the MS msq has been framed the options are being contradictory so this would not be that difficult question to handle with anyways you have to take its first derivative you have to compare with it you will be getting two stationary point among them one is going to be a maxima one going to be a minima so yes yes C and D is supposed to be the best most answer there in this given question. Uh, you can expect a different kind of the question and even in electrical and electronics, you may also get a question which had the two number of independent variables. So be prepared for that as well. In the same sequence, let me take few more number of questions. Yeah, here the two matrices were given. This has been matrix A and here matrix B. The determinant of a matrix A and B has been written as a debt of A, debt of B. Yeah, agreed and taking the reference of this debt a debt b what they had asked actually what they had asked let me have a look on it because that calculation part had gone down yeah which one of the options are being true determinant of a is equals to zero determinant of b is equals to minus of determinant of a similarly the four different options were given and this has been a kind of msq but being msq i suppose there should be more than one correct answer but here it was only one answer see once you'll focus over the option a and b you'll get to know see the r3 has been swapped in its place and if the r3 has been swapped in a place obviously the determinant would just get multiplied with minus sign and you get the answer over there you get the answer over there And here, this has been a problem based on the probability. Although most of the time we get a word problem where we need to find the probability, but here they had given a little bit a bit different ways. The two two coins are being tossed. Total four number of sample in space are being framed, and they had asked out of this how many options are being correct. It's again been a time of MSQ. Uh, you you can check it out. You had to use the formula if P of A intersection B stands for P of A into B, that's done. That's done. Yes. If it has been satisfied, the given given events A and B is going to be independent event. So probably I had solved it. Um, B and C and probably you can check it out A. A and C were correct answer. And in future you can guess this kind of the questions may also get asked. Yes. Agreed? in the same sequence i think i should take few number of questions from mechanical as well so you guys will have a larger sample space and you can analyze well which kind of the questions are being asked yeah see this problem was the problem from kochi ramayan equation if u of x is being equals to of v of y and u of y is being equals to minus tens of v of x the given complex function used to be analytic in nature anyways taking the reference of that concept you need to find the value of k you can expect this kind of the question exactly i won't say this question would get repeated but yes complex variable is always been an important topic for the electrical as well as electronics you can have a reference of it second order linear differential equation keep in mind 
this has been a reducible form of linear differential equation with constant coefficient yes and i feel this question may get repeated such a important topic it had been for electrical as well as electronics electrical as well as electronics so i would say don't miss it don't miss it what we do y is equals 3 to the power of t and then d d anyways you had to read this thoroughly you had to read this thoroughly yes no yes let me go back see again i need to find the value of k the same question uh, another question was a straight most question what it was sir here a vector field f vector has been given we need to find its closed surface integration my dear friend if you had to find its closed surface integration you can use gauss divergence theorem once you'll take a divergence of it that becomes zero so obviously closed surface integration is also being zero my dear friend my final verdict would be electrical electronics definitely one 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 question is going to come from vector calculus for any doubt without any doubt possibly one question is coming to come uh, possibly one question is coming from 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 complex variable one question is supposed to come from linear algebra probably maxima minima definitely one question is supposed to be there and at least one question from integration side so i would request to all of you be ready for tomorrow examination bye bye take care